Seattle has a dark side, and it's a side that many don't see. Late every night, women and girls are turned out to the streets to be bought and sold for sex. Because of Seattle's geographical location and unique historical stance on free sex, it stands as a major hub in the global sex trade. But there is light in the darkness. Jesus is building his church in our city and he's sending us into the streets of Seattle to reach these women with the gospel. We are seeing Jesus free people from slavery and give them rest. Hi, this is Pastor Tim Gatos from Marshall Church in downtown Seattle. This is Deacon Amanda Hightower, Marshall downtown, and here in Seattle, we've got a huge problem. We have one of the highest rates per capita of any city in the country with women and girls involved in sex trafficking. In fact, we're standing on top of the church in Belltown, right along what used to be called Flesh Avenue, which where the largest brothels in the world used to be housed in our city's sordid past. Now we are tired of seeing women and girls in slavery and bondage, and we wanna see the gospel go out into our city and see people, girls redeemed, and Amanda has formed an incredible ministry to reach out to these women and girls involved in sex trafficking called REST. Amanda, tell us a little bit about what's going on. REST is an outreach ministry to women and girls who are involved in the sex trade. And so we've just been called by God to go out into the streets, into strip clubs, visiting bikini barista stands, and just meet these girls, get to know them, build relationships. We want to help meet their needs and just invite them out of slavery. And we are just praying for transformation to take place in our city. You guys have already seen some, some fruit come out of some great relationships already that you've been able to build. Yeah, absolutely. We get to see the same girls multiple weeks in a row. And we've already had relationships being built, meeting with girls outside of the nightlife, inviting them into church. And we have girls that are wanting to leave the life, which is amazing. It's incredible got a huge vision for this ministry. We need many people to be involved. We want to raise awareness. We want to get our men involved to come alongside of our women that are serving these gals. This is a really incredible, important ministry, and we need many people involved in this. So what we're doing is October 19th, we're having a, a huge night of awareness called Town Hall, Sex Trafficking and the Gospel. And we want to just raise awareness around Mars Hill and the city of Seattle about what's going on, how you can be involved, and how you can be praying for this ministry so we can see less women and girls involved in sex trafficking here in our city. And Amanda, I know you guys need a lot of help. We do. We need a lot of help, especially the men. I mean, that might sound surprising, but every night that we're out, we see so many men driving around looking for girls to purchase. And it just breaks our heart, and so we need the men to help with that. Absolutely. So, look forward to seeing you out October 19th, 7 o'clock, Marshall Church downtown for sex trafficking and the gospel.